Hello and welcome today. I'm going to be sharing with you some information on how to order your groceries online for pickup or delivery. I've decided to cover this subject because I've had some people that were apprehensive about using these services and I wanted to be able to give you step-by-step uh, -step information on how to do this if you're interested in this with contactless um, delivery or pickup. So the, I only picked two different ones um, to show you because most of them are the same uh, or at least similar and the two that I chose were um, Aldi's and Walmart and these are local stores in Salem and of course there's other places like Giant Eagle um, I know that a lot of people use and they're very similar to how you set up the pickup and delivery from Aldi's or Walmart. So let me go ahead and get started. If you are wanting to shop from Aldi's, if you type into your browser Aldi, it will come up and the first choice would be this and I would click it and it brings you to the website. As you can see across the top, um, it's got the products, weekly special, pickup, delivery, and recipes. So we're going to click on the pickup and delivery, and it will prompt you to this page. Now, there is an app that you are able to download and put it on your mobile device if you like. It even prompts you for that here, Shop Aldi's US, um, and you can just click that and shop. You can enter your zip code if you're not sure if they deliver to your area. Um, then you will have to make an account for to use these services, but that's very easy also. So I'm just going to go ahead and click Start Shopping. And it will come up and it will prompt you. So I'm going to put in Salem zip code and let's see what it says. It, it says yes we are available and it will prompt you to go ahead and sign up with your email so you have an account so you put your first name your email address and a password and then you will sign up with your account once you log into your account this is what the main page of the website looks like you have the delivery option right here and then you also have the pickup option so we're going to work on the pickup option uh, option right now if you click pickup and you have the choices of the times over here so once you click that it will give you information about it um, it gives you delivery times that are available if you click all delivery times it will show you the delivery times in the next today and through the next few days that are available for pickup so um, here are the times for Friday and these are delivery times and you can do more times for that you also have the option to determine pickup times so you can click all pickup times and it will show you the times that you can go. Now, you may notice there is a charge for different things. Pick, pickup is $1.99 for pickup services and delivery is $3.99 for services. But um, this is for orders that are $35 or more. So basically, all you have to do is you just go through and you put items in your cart. So say so you want berries, you want two of them, you can do two, three, four, five, six, whatever, and then you click add to your cart. And then it'll say one item in cart. And then it will give you related items down here to actually put in your cart if you want to. Um, and then you can just continue adding them to your cart, whatever you want. And as far as shopping goes, it'll say departments. You can bring that up and it'll show you all the different departments that they have items in to shop at Aldi's. And you just click on the department and it brings up the item. And then you can just choose it and add it to your cart just like that if you want to. As you can see up here on the top right, you can see all the items that I have in my cart to this point. And when I'm ready to check out, I go down to where it says go to check out. And it'll bring up my cart and you want to double check and make sure 
that you have the correct store here and then you can choose your pickup times by days so the next pickup time is tomorrow I could choose one of them that way or you can choose even into the next week so once you choose which one you want you click choose uh, make sure there is a number in there for you and then you have to put your payment in and then you place your pickup order and once you place your pickup order uh, you just go to the store during those times so say I picked between 11 and noon tomorrow you would go to the store there is clearly marked spots there that you just drive up to to that spot to pick it up and then just tell them that you're there and they will bring the groceries out to you. So that's how Aldi's works as far as putting the groceries in your cart and going through the entire order to order them. And like I said, if you like to do that through a mobile app, you can do that that way also. And if you want to deliver it instead of the pickup, you would just choose the delivery instead. So the next one I want to show you is Walmart. You just type in walmart.com again you will have to create an account to be able to do your pickup and delivery but when you get on this main page um, you you'll see it down here it says pickup or delivery or up in the top left is pickup delivery and that's where you can start your order um, for Walmart so I'm gonna click that and you'll get prompted if this is the first time which is very nice it walks you through this um, it has a get started and it explains if you would like to watch the video on how to do it it'll show you how to choose pickup or delivery um, opt-in substitution that type of thing so I would suggest that if you're gonna use Walmart go ahead and watch that quick little video it's very nice and, and has a lot of detail for you you're going to click start shopping and it will come up like this and on the left hand side it it will see these three dots and if you click that that will drop down and it'll give you all the departments for the different food areas or areas that you're able to shop for pickup or delivery now my suggestion is first when you get here um, right now our area the Walmart does not have delivery so you will have to actually go there and pick it up in one of the spots so what you're going to do is you're going to go here reserve a time slot and then you're going to click see times and then you're going to log in if you haven't created an account you will create an account and you will sign into your account and once you are in your account um, you'll see this up at the top the pickup make sure the store here is the correct store this is the store in Salem you're gonna click see times and it what it will do it will show you the times that are available today the only time available is this evening uh, then you could go tomorrow and you can see the pickup there is free there's no extra charge for pickup um, and I have used this many many times and it's very easy to use um, they do have the app which is very nice because it will track you to pick up your delivery and you basically drive in and it knows that you are there and you tell them what slot you're in and they bring it out but if you don't you don't have to have the app to do this you can just order here online and then once your order is complete you will get an email that tells you when your order is ready for pickup although you do pick a time slot you will need to arrive between that time slot and when you drive into your slot all you have to do is call the number on the sign um, tell them what slot you're in and your name and they will bring your order right out to your vehicle and put it in there for you I'm going to go over here and I am going to go to the eggs and dairy let's see what we got in the eggs and dairy um, so it will come up like this and it will give you suggestions um, by different categories here you can put certain things right in here so say you just want milk you could type milk in there um, but they also have it here so I'm gonna click milk 
and say you want buttermilk, you're just going to add it to the cart and you can see over here on the right the items um, that I've added. Now one thing for pickup that they do require is you have to have a $35 minimum. Uh, so if I had $35 in there, um, it, it will come up, but as you can see I try to click it to check out because I only have $5 and it's telling me I have to have $30. So uh, once you get all those groceries in there, I'm just going to go down through and add a bunch of things right now just so I can show you what it looks like um, to check out. Okay, at $35, I'm going to click check out. Uh, continue to check out. And this is where you have the pickup option. Determine when you can pick it up. One very nice thing about Walmart is they have certain hours for at risk only to come and pick up and that's early in the morning as you can see um, from 7 to 8 they have those options so that's very nice that they have that. So if I choose a time and I click continue it will take me to my cart so I can see what it looks like. Here are all my items in my cart and then I will go down and all I have to do is click place order right here and once I pr place that order um, I will get an email telling me that my order has been placed and it will tell me on the date that I have chosen that my order is ready for pickup and you just drive into the spot and call the number and pick up your order so I hope that this gave you a easy overview of how easy it is to pick it up um, and I hope that you're able to use these services to help you have contactless delivery and pickup. Have a great day!